especially since this thing just set up where its home base is out in the water because it did not register right away. So I got to fix. There we go. Okay. YouTube. Lenny Besterman out here on Anna Maria Island, and this is the Rod and Reel Pier, which the city pier was. If you look to our my left, and that's your left too also, I'm looking at the screen, you'll see there is um, a crane down there and they are going to rebuild the old pier. They're just starting that now. I'm here at the end of January 2019 to get a couple more shots for the edit that we are putting together for the old pier that we have footage about. And I'm out here doing that now, but this is a beautiful place to come out and check out. We're out here on Anna Maria Island in Manatee County, Bradenton, Florida, Sarasota Experience. And um, many people have asked me to film this place, and I have before, but this is the first YouTube Live. And I'm going to show you what this beautiful key looks like. We're just close to Bean Point, and I'll show you what that looks like. I did a Facebook Live a couple weeks ago from that area over there. And it's, this key is, is stupid. It's so beautiful. Absolutely stunning. You're flying at 300 feet and it's probably six, it's 600 feet away from me. And I'm going to head south a little bit. I believe that's south. Am I south? Yes. And we're going to head down to by the Bean Point area. Got to be able to keep this thing in visual sight. So I'm going to be questionable on how far I can go. But there's Bean Point in a very, very interesting area. We did a Facebook Live earlier today from Coquina Beach, and there was a shark that was flying under the drone, which is absolutely Maximum awesome. Flight altitude reached. That means we're 363 feet. We're legal at 400, in case you're wondering. That's You're looking at Anna Marie Island at 363 feet with the old pier right underneath us. I want to say hi to Bay Breeze Getaways. We were able to uh, stay at their place six months ago and featured Anna Marie Island, and his place is so close to this, you can park there and walk right across the way. I highly recommend you go check out that uh, when you're in the area, if you can. But anyways, you can see there's plenty of rental places all through this island that is absolutely beautiful paradise. And I can say nothing more than what you're seeing on how beautiful Anna Maria Island is. This, go, this is the very end of Anna Maria, and it goes all the way down to Coquina Beach on Longboat where it meets up, and it's just great. Egmont Key, which uh, I believe I said that right, which is all the way the opposite end. You're going to be able to see po probably, I doubt it very clearly because of the resolution, but the Skyway Bridge is at a distance. And you're also going to be able to see, there's Egmont Key right there. It's a state park. I believe that's what it's called. I'm 90% sure, but many boats and helicopters go out that way. And that's the south end of St. Pete. And... Um, I'm just a modern guy that goes out and talks about Sarasota and surrounding areas. So there could be some mistakes. I'd love you to fix that mistake if I made one in the comments. This is known for how clear the water is. And it really is a freaking beautiful, beautiful. Um, you'll see uh, in the next day or two, you will see a link with a card that will lead you to the edit for the old pier on Anna Maria Island. And I'll tell you what. The water that's in that video is not edited or altered in any way, and that's truly what it looks like most of the time. There must be some rain or a storm coming in, and we did have a very rough red tide season this past year, 2018, heading into 2019, and it was a freaking disaster. So maybe the water is not healed completely, but um, absolutely stunning beautifulness if you ever have a chance to get out to Anna Marie Island there are plenty of restaurants and shops and places and it is probably the one most hidden what I like to say is say it respectfully old-fashioned gem that is out of control beautiful um, I stayed at with Bay Breeze getaways and everything shut down at like 9 10 o'clock and it was like a Sunday night but it was just that old fashioned, beautiful, quiet, drive your golf carts, let your kids jump in the golf cart, drive around type of atmosphere that this country misses more than likely because uh, it's not a common thing anymore. And that's not a knock on any, any other areas, but it's very unusual. Let's see if you can see that tanker coming across into Tampa Bay from a distance over by Egmont Key. 
I'm slowly turning here. Give me one second. Let's see if we can get that shot for you because that's pretty spectacular from my point of view. You can see it. It almost looks like a little piece of land going from left to right. And that's a big oil tanker. That's where all our cruise ships and things go into Tampa Bay. Uh, the Tampa Bay port uh, brings a lot of these ships in. And uh, it's just, it's, it's pretty neat. So the Coast Guard helicopter is very far away, but I just saw that blast right through here on the other side of the key out at a distance. You could probably see it. I'm not sure. It's going to be a little speck if you can. But anyway, this is a, a beautiful area and you got the old, you got the Rod and Pier great fishing and they are building the next city pair to replace the one that was put in in 1911. And it came to an end because of Irma damage for its fifth major storm that did damage to that pier, but it was not fixable this time. That was done in September of 18, and it officially was ripped down the end of 18, just so you know. So I'm going to get you one more shot. We'll fly around this pier so you can check it out. Make sure you come go up and tell the people Sarasota Experience sent you. Nothing better than letting them know where they heard about this place. And if we truly were the first ones to tell you about it, if you could do that for me, that would be great. Share the post out to any of your friends that may be interested in seeing this. A lot of people love Anna Marie Island. It is in the top five in the world for islands to vacation. It's ranked there all the time. It's within a 30 minute drive to Siesta Key Beach, which is always in the top 10 beaches in the world. It's usually number one or number two. This year it was in the top five from what I understand, but it's usually one or two. Very special area, Sarasota, Bradenton, and surrounding areas. So we hope that you able you are able to come visit, check it out, and enjoy paradise. Uh, many people move here from other parts of the country, or vacation here, and uh, are willing to come up, pick up, and move. So that says a lot, in my opinion. But that's a pretty cool shot right there of the pier. And um, anyway, Lenny Besterman with Sarasota Experience. YouTube share it out to your friends that may be interested in seeing I'm standing next to the pier. I like to do a Shot let me see if I can get over here real quick show you where I'm standing Parking in the rear old pier, so I'm gonna fly down to me Right here, and I'll do my signature shot of what they call the pull away shot There are all kinds of wildlife and beautiful things in this area all the time people there is sharks whale sharks dolphins everything you can imagine and this right here oh that's some good stuff just big Huge, massive beauty comes out of nowhere all the time. It's beautiful. Let me get it back Maximum here. I'd like to go a little bit further. Reached. Talk to you soon. Anna, Florida area. Have a good day.